Okay, here we are, week four, ready to get started. I'm very excited about this uh, presentation that I've created. A lot of research and a lot of knowledge that I gained from the process. I'm very happy and we're going to get right into it. Okay. Let's go, keep going, keep going. Okay. All right, so here <clears throat> I managed to get a forecast of e-learning and uh, actually up to 2028. And as you can see, e-learning has increased all across the board, which is quite an uh, confusing to me even full sale has had increase in uh, enrollment but somehow stlcc declined so hopefully this will help them but this tells you the year and the amount of enrollment across the nation and here i have the risk avoidance I used the risk from above and I went and I wrote ways to avoid this from happening and I'm really happy with the results and a lot of it is common sense but I want to I wrote it down anyway because this is step by step and I don't want to miss any steps and I also have my total con quality control Things that STLCC needs to make sure that their process is done correctly. And as you can see, they are all here, all 14. And I have my Six Sigma, which is so important when it comes to e-learning with the low cost and the high productivity is is undeniably needed and it's basically you cannot function without it or if you are functioning without six sigma you are definitely losing money and the process analysis i did it from a student standpoint of the processes that they would go through to get their information and studies and how the system will be used and we have our conclusion that uh, sums up everything from this process that I have done I am very happy with this and this presentation is exactly what I needed to understand the process that I'm going to have to go through with STLCC. I think that this whole report was done with the thoughts of once again um, i don't want to sound redundant but i really want to make a change in the world and i think that this is very important this is not fictional this is a real thing that could happen and real people have done this before so we can learn i have learned and hopefully stlcc can learn from the processes of the people before them and how I put this together to show how important it is to get education into the prison systems and how this will help STLCC get out of debt. They are looking for customers and students to enroll and we have a whole population of people waiting on change and this is the change that they need this is the change that st louis needs this is the change that every community that has a large population of prisoners 
could use this, whether it's abroad or domestic. This is an opportunity for STLCC to reclaim their fame. They are actually a really good school with really great teachers. They just don't have the people to teach. So hopefully this is enough for, well not hopefully, I know this is enough to complete this class. And I'm dreadfully grateful for the things that I've learned in this class. And I look forward to the next course. Thank you for watching.